the toughest games you're ever in, the ones where you're really playing somebody that's really at their best and you're at your best, your mind goes blank. So the crowd are not there, the cameras are not there, nothing's there, just that. Straight the way down, and that would be the centre, there. There's my grip. So you're not looking where they are, you're looking at your travel 20. I'm aiming right at the centre. So if I'm aiming for treble 20, I'm aiming right for the centre, treble 20. And as you throw your first dart, you then keep your eyes fixated, pull that out of your hand, remember the strength you've just thrown the last dart. And that becomes like a muscle memory. It all depends how long I practice for. Um, sometimes I'm better, and maybe I can do the set regime in one and a half hours. Sometimes I'm not so good, it might take me three hours. Once you practice, you'll find your range, what will suit you better. But if you can sometimes experiment, maybe make it longer or make it shorter, but you'll have to find whatever suits you. People are different. That's what's going through your head. You've got to start from there. It's not just about this. Like throwing the ball. Like throwing something soft through the air. Like if you're going to throw some paper at somebody, nice and steady, think like a feather. It's my life, it's, it's what I do for a living, it's my job. And it's something that I really, really enjoy. The day I took up darts is the day I finished working on a factory. It's the day that I became very, very wealthy. And it's, um, it's changed my life completely.